Hello everyone and welcome to another video. I know there have not been many lately and I've had some concerned comments from people. And last time I did mention that I hadn't been very well but I was on the mend. Well it turns out I had a bit of a relapse so I've had a couple of weeks of not being very well at all. But I'm much much better now. So thank you for all your concerned comments and worrying about me but I'm fine now. Anyway, enjoy tonight's video. It's just a little bit about some, a little project that Tony's been getting on with and a brocant that we went to and we met up with some of our viewers, which was lovely. Please give us a thumbs up if you like it. doing with these stones Tony? These are going to be my foundation. For what? For my wall. Okay. Oh it's a bit breezy out here. Uh, so what you're doing is you're creating a bed, a flower bed yes. in the corner of the garden just to tidy it up a little bit. Yes. And so I can grow a few more flowers and things. And then I'm thinking. That looks heavy. That's because it is. <laughs> oh, we're not doing the stone table thing again, are we? Yes, but in a different Oh no, he's just called me out. <laughs> right, and then... Have we got a sack barrow? No, not, not heavy enough for that. Oh. I don't think so anyway. And didn't we have a sack barrow here? I don't know. That would be the easiest option, wouldn't it? I thought we did. Yeah, I thought we did. Yeah. Ah, uh, you probably lent it to someone. Uh, no, then, we had the no. We've not. We don't have a big one. We've got the little tiny sack barrow. That that's over there. I can see it here. Yeah. I'm not sure that's strong enough. No, it's not. Okay. What's the plan then? And then. <laughs> uh, which way did you go? Huh? Oh, it's very breezy out here. Sorry if there's wind noise. Right. Ah. Yeah, because we need to work out what to do with these extra pieces of stone. Ah. Oh. As a seat? Yeah. What do you mean a seat? How does that be a... It's a bit low. It's going to be a little bit <laughs> I'm not sure what you're getting at there. So we'll put them down first, in there. Yeah. And we'll put these on top of it. You can also twin as a seat. Oh, I see what you mean. So, sort of like, um, like a raised bed. Yes. But that you can sit on the edge. Yes. Okay. Feet. Well, obviously, I'll film it once you've done it, Tony. I can't sort of visualise it quite yet. Right. Um, over this corner over here, we talked about, aren't we? So, down by the river. Now. I already planted a lot of raspberry canes over here because I wasn't I was running out of places to put them. So I will about. replant those once It'll Tony's done. Ah. Here. Oh I see. Okay. That's the, it's not a bad idea, but I do have to be able to get into it to weed it. Well you can step over it. I'll climb over it. Not climb over it, you step over it. <laughs> Go on, how high is it gonna be? Here. Fifty. So, but the ground is going to be this height. Yes. No? So it's not going to be 50, is it? Once we filled this, there's a big dip in the grass here, but once we filled here. that, so the actual bit we can sit on will be like my raised beds over there. Yeah. Well, we quite quite perch on the edge of there, don't no, we? We'll put that in the middle. Yeah. And it will be about here, and then I'll build up either side. Okay. With stones. Sounds good. So yeah, I'm gonna I shall replant my rhubarb into this bed. I'll plant some dahlias and some bulbs. And I have a camellia in a pot which can go in here. And 
we'll take it from there and I shall move the raspberries along so that I can reach them from inside my veggie garden yeah as long as I can get to it to weed it and you can get to it once a year to trim this this tree back because we can't get it out of the wall we just chop it back each year don't we Right, that's what we're doing. Okay, it's going to tidy this area right up though, isn't it? And I like the idea of sitting here. So we will sit here with our back. There we are, and that will be our view when we're sitting down here having a cup of tea. Quite like that. Right, I'm going to set the camera up so that we can see Tony doing the job. <laughs> big pile of muck because <laughs> it's just mortar um, lime mortar lime and seed. yeah and this is for the flower bread project yeah. right i'm just going to go out and have a look how you're getting on right. you've obviously got to the stage where you need to mortar the stone yeah, sorry the trouble with this stuff is you mix it up and you think it's wet enough yeah then you walk away from it and you don't realize it's still soaking up the water and you come back and it's like a big brick. Oh. But yeah. Right That's quite a lot to mix up by hand. Well, I can't be bothered to mess me... Uh... <laughs> mess your mixer up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you only need one lot, don't you? Hopefully. Hopefully, yeah. Well, I'm going to go out to the garden and see how you're getting on out there. Yeah. Oh, ooh. It's looking a little bit different. Oh, it's looking quite a lot different. Oh, and he's already put some of the water in. That's what he means by going away and then he comes back and it's too dry. Oh, that's going to look good. Love that. Oh, I have to find some things to plant in it now. And Tony wants to put two more pieces of stone on the top of this so that it also becomes a seat because along the front here we'll be filled in so you won't see all this stone you'll only see a little piece of it because the grass will be brought up to level where it's sunk down a bit this is where if you've been watching us for a long time you would remember there was a huge pit at the side of the river. We never did discover what it was for. We think maybe latrines, but as it was the furthest from the house. Anyway, we filled it all in, but of course it's sunk down. It's sunk down about a foot in some places. So we need to bring that back up to level and reseed that so that the grass is flat. Oh, he's been busy, hasn't he? Ooh, did you hear the woodpecker? Well, it's not quite so nice today. But pleasant enough. Right. I'll show you when Tony's get gets a bit further on. You already started then? Yes. That's what you mean by it drying out quick? Oh, yes. Ah, right, okay. Not a bad place to work. No. <laughs> oh. 
little cats come to see what Donnie's up to. <laughs> Come on in. Hello. Hey, gorgeous. Isn't she pretty? <laughs> uh, no, it's not another cat toilet. <laughs> Look at the bedsides. Uh, very rich, right? There's that thing again. Now, a lot of people have suggested it's for croquet mallets or possibly for guns. Croquet man, it's probably the most likely. Is that thing again, Tony? The mystery yes. object? Yes. A lot of people suggested it's for croquet, and you know, that would make sense, I think. Anyway. Yeah, I like these chairs, Tony. Did you see? Yes. That one's particularly high. Old peacock chair, look. <laughs> Ah. Four candles. Four candles, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. <laughs> I like the chicken on the toilet. The restaurant is very good. I'm sorry. The child's chair to go on the back of the bike. You wouldn't mm. put your child in that nowadays, would you? No. No, health and safety and all that. Glasses. <laughs> That's very, very pretty. Oh, look at all the cups. Mm. Yeah. Well, it's still got labels on it. What does it say? Limoges. But then it's a lot of Limoges pottery. PP. I don't know. It's very pretty. Eh? Saucers, big pile of saucers over there mm. as well. It's rather sweet. Uh, 
Ah. This is what Tony's sister bought two of last time she was here. It's like a wall pocket. <laughs> Anything? No? Oh. Not much in here, but go spread. Log box. And a giant uh, bellows. Oh, there's another long one. Yeah. That takes back in time, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Well, I think we've seen enough. Yeah. Oh, look at that, look, it's a mini, like, almost like a camping kit. Mm. Have a wash. Elle l'avait mis en situation ou elle avait mis des fleurs dessus Je crois qu'elle le vendait sans vrai. On est fou à la pression de choses, on sent. Bordeaux j'ai le bleu mais beaucoup plus foncé donc euh, on une Merci. vous voulez pas détendre les that picture is the château de Sarzé which is quite close to here Going to see you there. Oui. 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 It's quite nice, a little bit big for my collection. C'est pas grave, madame. <laughs> c'est moi qui vais avoir la fortune. Huit, c'est bon. C'est beaucoup. Mais non, le copier était. Est-ce que vous pouvez euh, me sortir ces deux là, s'il vous plaît Elle va bien, elle va très bien même. Non, faut pas sexy. Oui, oui, alors de tout coup, euh, affecté. Bon, je trouve ça fait bien, mais vous, pour l'instant. Oh, 
they're nice. Aren't they? Oh, they're really heavy. Are they? Yeah, feel. They're solid. Yeah. 30 euros. 30. For, for, for the pair? For... 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Count. 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 Oh, no. No. Okay. Alright, we'll have a think. We'll go to the bar and have a think. Joan of Arc plate. Well, we didn't find anything today, so we're just going back to the bar to have a drink with Patrick and Stuart. Oh, I can see them in the background. Oh, everyone's there. All our friends. And a couple of people who have come to say hello who watched the vlog. That's Julie and Mike here. <laughs> Smile, you're on camera. <laughs> Would you like to say hello? Aww, <laughs> hi everyone. We've just come for a meetup. Hello, yeah. it's a lovely sunny Easter day now. Yeah. Okay. Did you find anything? No. It's a bit bit disappointing this well, one. Well, yeah, I agree. Yeah. You anyway, you let's have you can't find let's have a drink. Stuff. <laughs> you got it? So oh, yeah. <laughs> I've seen a guy. So what is that? Relic? Everything Turn the music off on the uh, fairground on Sisters Lake. He's been busy, look. We saw him building a wall out of some of the excess stones that we've got lying around the property. And yeah, it's gonna it needs to green itself up a little bit and get some plants growing over the top of it. Luke's created the proper bed behind it for me. So I'm going to replant the raspberry canes along this side and plant some others. I think I'm going to plant my camellia tree in there and some dahlias for some flowers. And I'll probably plant the rhubarb in there as well because that's taking up a lot of space. And at the same time, he's then levelled where the ground had sunk here by the river. He's levelled that off because there was a big pile of earth in the front of the barn, the front barn where the courtyard has been scraped a long time ago so he's removed a lot of that he's moved a lot of that and he's filled in the hole here and he's reseeded it so that's going to tidy that corner up a lot because it's always difficult to keep it tidy and i get a space to grow some extra flowers well thank you all for watching that i hope you enjoyed it and I know it was a short one this time, but I will be trying to catch up a little bit. I have filmed some things, although I wasn't very well. And I'm going to try and catch up over the next few days on a few things. Anyway, thank you all for watching. If you'd like to support the channel, you can watch the adverts or leave us a comment. We love to read your comments. I am still trying to catch up with some of those as well, so bear with me. Uh, you could buy us a coffee. I'll put the link for that. That's always very welcome. Anyway, just thank you all for watching and supporting us. Bye for now.